Rochdale Council hosted its third annual digital festival on Saturday, offering lessons on how to better use your mobiles or tablets, how to stay safe online and advice on how to get work in the digital industry. There can be little doubt that today we're living in an increasingly digital age, so it's no surprise that events like this one are becoming more and more common. With that in mind, I spoke to one of the organisers of today's event to ask them why they think it's so important. They are, they're really important because it's, it's, it's about kind of normalising using technology, so um, people might think because they can't use a certain device, they sometimes have a fixed mindset about that and they think, well that's it, I'm stuck, I'm not going to catch up. Um, but actually it's really easy to catch up with these things and to just try them out. Later on, I caught up with Carl Parr from High Tech Oldies. I asked him why he got involved in the digital industry. We, we found out that, that computer literacy, IT literacy was, was pretty poor, especially for those over the age of 50. And uh, the idea was basically to, to try and improve that. And have you heard any stories from people who have come onto your courses of occasions when they've been victims of online fraud or crime or anything like that? Speaking to half a dozen of the people in, in the group, uh, at least three of them had been scammed quite badly. Um, one, was, one chap was uh, scammed so much on an online fraud, the best part of £3,000. So we've heard one side of the story. I found out what visitors thought too. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm hopeless at using the, my phone to be a starter and I've just been to a lady there and she's put me right. How important do you think events like this are in helping people like yourself to actually get to grips with the digital age? Very important. Very important. Yeah. There, should, there should be more of this where people can just walk in and ask questions. You might not think of Rochdale as a hub for technology, but if the council has anything to say about it, that might just change. James Diamond, Keys News.